Hey everyone, welcome back. So I came back over here where we found that golf cart uh, before we rebuilt the base. And we're going to check out this cave next to it before I forget where it's located. There is a marker on it, so it should be easy to find. If we zoom out, we're located right here. Let's get in here before we take any damage and lose more armor. I went ahead and rebuilt some armor since the last episode. Hopefully this one's not as crazy as what we experienced before. So far looking uh, pretty safe. <sighs> All right, let's see what we have in here. Some printer ink. More ink, more food. Batteries. Let's see, wire, more printer ink. Duct tape. More batteries. Always good. Place to sleep and save. That's nice. Uh, if we get some arrows over here in the corner, we'll take all those. Okay, and a 3D printer, and a book. Parallel Universes book collected. Okay, so we can make arrows, I guess. Let's see, press E. Oh, I guess we're making that. I didn't want to make that. <laughs> Five 3D printed arrows. All right, so E obviously makes it with a R, we need a flask, a mask, Grappling hooks, tech mesh, that must be for the armor, a sled. What do we do with a sled? Takes up that. We can't build one yet. I wonder if that'll help us with move logs. Or do we just slide around the map like Turtle Shell used to let us do? Let's make a flask. I guess that's a picture of the tech armor. <laughs> it's like something from the running man. And the mask takes 150. Let's go make one of those. Red mask collected. So we've got 550 milliliters of printerism left. I think all we have left to make is, besides tech mesh, is the sled. How much is the tech mesh? 250 per piece. I guess we could save, log out, log in, and get the sled and see what that's all about. Let's take a look around and see what else we have in here. Probably just an exit if it's like the other caves that we've been to. Save it a watch. Some wire by that ladder. Money in a watch and a purse. <laughs> and we need to find a key card to get inside of there. Looking a lot like the old game. So let me see if I can save and reload and get some of that stuff together. I want to see it the sled. If it's made for logs, that'll make life a lot easier. What is that, a Roomba? Yeah. That's <laughs> what you need in a survival bunker, the Roomba. I don't see a card or anything in here. All right, so we loaded back in. We actually had enough ink. We just needed to add it to the printer itself. So you add ink by pressing E while looking at it. So we do have the sled now, so let's take that. Printed sled collected. Uh, we can go ahead and add more ink to, to this. That way we can carry it when we find some more. And we still need some of those tech pieces, so I guess we can try to print those if we have enough. 250 a piece. All right, let's see what we've got going on here. There's our turtle shell that has no purpose. Here is the sled. Oh, it's up here. <laughs> I guess the mask is, maybe that camouflages us so we can move around. I guess we'll take a look at the sled once we go outside. Where's that, where's the tech armor plates? So this requires one piece of the tech armor, wire, duct tape, circuit board, and batteries. There guys, so from there we're going to head up to this cave that's right above us. There is a another one of those mutants ro rolling around right here. Virginia was lighting him up. I don't know if she finished him or not. Nope, he's still up here. <laughs> and now he's after us that's great all right so into the cave we'll see if we can survive <laughs> really wish i had a gun or a better bow 
Alright, let's see. Canned food, raw meat. Limbs. Let's see, we've got watches. And cloth, so we can make some Molotovs. Let's go ahead and drink an energy drink, get our food and stuff right. Now hopefully this one's that full of enemies like the last one, because I don't know if we can handle it. I mean, it looks like tons of skulls in here. Somebody's a collector. I do see some mutants below us. At least one. Two more over there. Let's go and get some armor put on. That might be three. Alright, so that's actually four. <laughs> All right, let's see what we have over here. It was like a printout, FYI, this is what we were looking for. I think we're gonna go straight first to the dead ends like the last one. Cloth, duct tape, meds, more meds, slug ammo, wire, okay, not bad, a cross, <laughs> more ease, more meds over here, and some slug ammo, and I need, I need the shotgun, whatever that's for, some vodka, could use some vodka in real life right now. And I guess this is the ore they're looking for. Stay on the high side, see what happens. Oh, what is that? Yeah. Yeah, I think we're going to have to make a bomb for that thing. <laughs> yep, this will work. There's two time bombs off that guy. Let's see, this guy has nothing on him. So how do I use these bombs? Where the bomb? Oh, there they are. Well, that worked out pretty well. Can't lose it. Oh, it's got raw arms, raw arms and stuff. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't see anything but raw arms in, right there. So and legs. Let's keep moving. A little friendlies ahead. That guy is fast. Come here. The MRE laying on the floor right here by this body. Vodka, rope. Uh, more medicine we can't carry. Wait, is that guy dying or is he throwing up on everything? Oh, maybe he's mutating. Yeah, he... Alright, let's 
All right, something about something being trapped in a box and being worshipped. Thought there'd be some loot right here. All right, let's gear back up since they tore through our armor like it was paper. Oh, that's where they're coming from the ceiling. Okay. Wait, is that what is that? All right, how do I kill this thing? Let's see, hand grenade maybe? Well, that seemed to have done the trick. <laughs> Let's double check. All right, that's definitely dead. But there's another one. No. Oh no, can we beat that in a melee fight? Hit him with a good old Molotov. Alright buddy, where'd you go? Burned to death, leave me alone. Oh, he blocked me? Oh, what? Oh, uh, baby. Okay, that's not working. <laughs> Alright, um, what else do we have? I guess we can try the bow. It should be weak, right? After all the fire. Okay, hopefully there's not too many more of those. <laughs> There's so many. Now then, any good loot in here? Man, these caves are massive. Let's see, so we have a path here. I guess we'll stick to the left side. More of that ore. The crates. Let me stand my left. This is bad. All right, so when we died, the game loaded us back at where we found that first clipping or that email. There's another one laying here. I guess I missed it when we came through the first time. We've had to fight back through three of those mutant guys again or cave dwellers, whatever they are, aliens. Oh, and there's another one. 
really don't want to try to melee this guy. Let me see if I can get, uh, try to hit him with a Molotov. I don't know if he'll set us on fire, so I'm trying to wait for the fire to go up, and then we'll hit him again. So much for having tech armor. <laughs> they tore right through that. I'd like to be another printout or something right here, too. <laughs> don't know if we don't light it. There's so many of them. Alright, let's try the hand grenade. Right in my face. More enemies, not good, not good. Uh, of course they're gonna hang out together. <laughs> I'm bomb. Okay, time bomb is super effective. Okay, these babies look almost like toddlers. All the loot. A lot of killing. The two passageways. Which way to go? Buckshot. What is this? Newspaper. Not gonna help us at all. Why are there so many? This is not fair. Can I make a bomb? Oh, I don't want to make a bomb. I might need a bomb to get out. Let's see. Okay, it looks like they're killing each other, so that's good. One more to go. He looks pretty weak. Get the handy dandy axe back out. Oh, my God. 
The never ending cave continues. Alright, so here's the rope gun that we've been looking for. Now we should be able to zip line places. That cloth. Oh, I did not want to do that. I wanted to go the other way. No. Well, hopefully we didn't miss anything. I guess I'll have to walk back in here and take a look. Man, that's not cool. Can I go back up? I'm going to take that as a no. Oh no, what what is that? Oh it's gonna be Can't beat that thing in a one-on-one. -on -one. Right, let's look for loot and then we're gonna run. Get away from me. Where you going? Daylight. Where am I at now? Let's see. Okay, so we're near the 3D printer again, near our base. So we need to head back down there, do some saves, store some stuff. But I think we're going to call the video there for the rope gun because it's such a long run through that tunnel. So many fights. Lots of friendly natives out here. As always, guys, if that video helped you out, be sure to hit the like and subscribe button, and I'll catch you on the next one.